Snellen chart. Origin of the word. It comes from the name of German ophthalmologist Hermann Snellen who invented that chart to test visual acuity. But what does visual acuity mean? It means ability of the eye to discriminate between two separate points. But there is one condition. The eye must be completely relaxed. And that is the reason Snellen chart is placed at 6 meters from the patient. Why? Why is visual acuity tested at 6 meters? That is emetropic relaxed eye. And that is Snellen symbol at 6 meters from the eye. So the eye get clear vision while the eye is completely relaxed. When the symbol come closer than 6 meters, the eye get blurred vision. So the eye start its near accommodation to get clear vision. But in this case the eye is no longer relaxed. And we lose the condition for measuring visual acuity. On the other hand, when the symbol get far than 6 meters, the eye get blurred vision too. Even if the eye return to its relaxing state. That is because when Snell and symbol get beyond 6 meters, the angle of resolution become less than its minimum value 1 minute of arc. Now we will explain what is the meaning of angle of resolution, and how it is formed. First the light falls on two separated points, then reflected from the two points to the retina. The meeting point of the reflected light is called nodal point which is located 5.6 mm from the anterior surface of the cornea, and 17 mm in front of retina. That angle between two lights is called angle of resolution or visual angle. And that is the photoreceptor layer of the retina. The more angle of resolution, the more distance between stimulated photoreceptors, so I realize there is increase in the distance between separated points. While the less angle of resolution, the less distance between stimulated photoreceptors, so I realize there is decrease in the distance between separated points. The minimum angle of resolution equal 1 arc minute, and the minimal distance between stimulated photoreceptors is 4.5 micrometer. If the angle of resolution become less than 1 arc minute, the distance between stimulated photoreceptors will be less than 4.5 micrometer. But, what does that mean? That means the stimulated photoreceptors will be adjacent, with no unstimulated photoreceptors in between. So, there is no differential stimulation of photoreceptors. And the vision will be blurred.